In this chapter, we're going to look at the many facets of our boards, which, as we now know, really act like pages. So file open into the working folder and I'll open up the file called stationary AI. And then just to show you under view and fit all in window, this is the only artboard in this document. It is set up to be portrait A4 in size. Uh, fairly sparse design. We have, of course, logo, some text in the form of the contact details. That's stored in a layer called Info. We have a layer underneath called Guides, which only contains one item. It was originally a rectangle converted into a guide that we can see here by turning it off and turning it back on again. And it's just there as a way to create kind of a healthy margin around the outside of the page in there that the text is lined to. And we're going to create an additional artboard. So the quickest way to do that from here is to go to the properties panel and click on edit artboards and then adjacent to the name that we have in here is a plus. Now if I click on that, it creates a second artboard and as you can see here we have the bounding box wrapped around the active artboard in here. Um, the name is shown at the top left hand side in a label O2 artboard 2. And if I swipe over that, call that comp slip and you must hit the return key for that field to update in there, which you'll then notice in its corresponding label, O2 Complip, then updates. You can also create an artboard from the control panel at the top of the screen. So here we have the same symbol, left click, creates a third artboard. If at any point you wish to delete an artboard, then you can click on the delete artboard button in the control panel or hit the backspace key on the keyboard. The end result is the same. To exit artboard editing mode, you can click on the exit button at the top right hand side of the properties panel or you can hit the escape key on the keyboard. And from here, I'll go to view and choose fit all in window. And that's how you can create an artboard and how you can delete one.